video. What is good, guys? This is your boy, and I'm back in it again with another video. Today, man, I'm just gonna hop right into this. I'm gonna be telling y'all a story time about how I got my appendicitis, okay? So, basically, um, we're just gonna hop into this, okay? So, um, me and Connor went to the same school, okay? So, like, he'd stay at my house, I'd stay at his house, and this. This night or day or whatever you want to call it, I stayed at Connor's house, okay? And I woke up at like 3 o'clock in the morning. Um, and school doesn't start till 8.10. So, yeah, it's like very, very early for till when I have to wake up. And, um, my stomach was like killing me, like far too worse. Like hurt, okay? And, um, I, I was just laying there for a little bit because, you know, I'm just thinking I'm just like, um, waking up and I just have like a normal stomach ache so I'll just go back to sleep and it'll be over when I wake up go to school and everything like that but no that was not the case <laughs> um I actually wake up and it's killing me so bad I cannot go to sleep and you feel me it's hurting so bad I'm, I'm like no I'm not getting up so I'm like Connor I wake him up he goes and gets his mom because you know I'm not about to get up it hurts so bad and she told me just go back to sleep because it's probably just a stomach just a normal stomach ache and I was like, no, nah, it hurts. And she was like, really? And I was like, yeah. So she got me medicine. Sorry, this is a little details. It really doesn't matter. But she got me medicine. And um, I took it. I don't remember what it was. But it did not help. Not even the slightest bit. So she was like, get in the bath. Maybe warm water is going to make your stomach hurt. I mean, not hurt. Make it feel better. So I got in the hot water bath. Like hot, very hot. And um, honestly, it wasn't that hot because I didn't care. But um. Oh, it did not work. I mean, it was kind of working, but, it, like, when I get out, instantly, bam, start back hurting. And I started moaning and stuff, and uh, so she moved me out to the couch because she didn't want me to stay in there. Because she didn't want to have to keep going back and forth into Connor's room and her room because she didn't want to wake the other, you know, Connor makes it up. So, she um, moved me to the front room so she can go in there easier and, like, not wake people up. And, um... Basically, I still stayed up to like four o'clock, like a whole hour staying up. And um, I woke back up at like five, still hurting as bad as can be. And um, she she got me, and she was like, "I'm gonna text your mom because I don't think you should be going to school today. How bad it hurts." And you know me, I'm a kid. I'm like, "Hey, no school." But you know me, it's more like, oh, "Yeah, no school, bro. No school." Okay, but um. Honestly, it was a fun experience, but no, 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 I'm not going to say this, I'll, I'll give you this at the end. Um, we dropped Connor and Mason off at the school, my mom was like, alright, I believe you, I mean, not I believe you, but you, you, she was like, okay, if it hurts that bad, yeah. So, we dropped Connor and Mason off at the school, and I'm staying in the car thing and because my stomach's starting to feel better, okay? And, um, bro, um, we went to Kroger, she got me medicine. And, um, we came back, you know, I took it, did not hurt. It, it was, it started to blow away. Like, it wasn't hurting that bad. I mean, my stomach was hurting the entire day. But, like, it wasn't hurting as bad as it was when I first woke up. Like, I cannot explain how bad it hurt. And, um, um, I got home at, like, I don't know, after school when they, when Connor and Mason got out. And, um, my mom told me if it hurts like, later on tonight, when it gets nighttime, if it still hurts, we'll take you to the hospital. I was like, okay. And still hurt. Medicine wasn't working. Nothing was working. So we took to the hospital. Basically, they, to make a long story short, I sat in a room with no TV, a bed, for like three hours. Nothing to do, but I put on my phone for a little bit. And took that long just to see if I had anything wrong with my stomach. And I don't remember what they first thought it was, but... They didn't think it was appendicitis. My mom did, but they didn't. The doctors only didn't think they would. So they freaking um. I had people visit. Um, shout out to my Mima. Yeah, I just I was my grandma, but I called Mima. Shout out to Mima. Shout out to Connor, Mason, his little, their little sister, and Aunt Tonto for visiting me while I was in this horrible three hours. But um, yeah, they all visited me, so that came you know kept me some company. Oh, and I'm pretty sure. My aunt Elisa came too, but I don't remember if it was when. No, 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 I don't remember if it was then or the next day. I don't remember. Oh, I remember. Okay, so they um they took me to 
this little thing and they put like you know i got the shot right there it didn't hurt i don't know why like, I'm, i always remember just like ah but they put a shot right here you know so you can inject medicine through and stuff and they put in something when i got i got um on this my you know my little bed and i was laying down they took me into this like scanner that would like go like this like it was like it was like a huge circle thing and i'd be laying down like that and go over me and like scan my body you know like 3d actually i don't know how the doctors do it but um Bro, the medicine was weird because he told me to, you know, be ready for this. It made, like, my, like, private area started getting warm. Like, I felt like I peed myself. Like, I thought, hey, hey this medicine, like, makes you pee yourself or something. And then my whole body started getting warm in the back of my throat. It started getting very warm. And I'm like, I think I just peed myself, doctor. And, he, and I was like, mom, I'm pretty, I feel like I just peed myself. And she's like, no, it's just a medicine. Yeah, it was just a medicine. I didn't pee myself. But, um, Yeah. They figured out it was, I had appendicitis, okay? My appendix was going to rupture if I didn't. But I caught it fast enough so it didn't rupture. And um, they were like, hey, he's too young for us to do it here. So I got transferred I got transferred to a children's hospital that took another hour or two just sitting there. And then um, I got transferred. The two people were cool. I don't know their names, but shout out to both of them. I don't know. Um, uh, it was to be honest, the cart, like, it was fun, because, you feel me, I've been on, um, um, ambulance, transportation, or whatever you want to call it, I've been on those, but half the time, I wasn't, like, fully thinking, because I was little, and for other stuff to happen, if y'all want me to know, if y'all want to hear about that, let me know, leave it down in the comment section below, and, um, basically, I was there, and it was pretty cool, because the doctor was cool, he, I mean, not the doctor, I don't know what to call him, but he was, he was cool, he was making jokes with me and stuff, because, keep in mind, I, it was not hurting, at that time, it was not hurting, but it's probably because all the pain medicine they put in and stuff, but, my mom rode with me, and then my, okay, this is what I remember, Mima, my Mima picked up my aunt, and they met us at the, um, at the hospital, at the children's hospital, and we went there, Basically, they're like, hey, um, you're staying overnight. We're going to do this in, like, what, 8? I'm pretty sure they did it, like, 8 or 12. I don't know. <laughs> I just you know it was one of those. And um, so I got the surgery done. They, like, cut a hole in my stomach. Like, not holes, but they cut little things. In my stomach here, here, and somewhere over here. Like, the, they put one right here. It's like, I don't know if you can see it. Oh, right there. Then they got me in my belly button, but that didn't hurt. I mean, but that's not still here. And then I got that. But, um, yeah, I know I'm fat. Don't judge me. But, um, I'm not that fat. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just off topic. Um, yeah, that's where they got me. And then I stayed there. I don't remember if I stayed there another night or I left that day. I don't remember. But the thing was, it was a children's hospital, bro. I'm, I'm like, um, I'm not going to get my religion really out there. But I'm I'm not that I'm not that little. Okay, let's just say I'm, can't say that either. I'm not gonna say my age. Uh, let's say I'm 14. Okay, we'll say that. I'm just not like little. Okay, they were treating me like I'm three. Okay, sweetie, we're gonna take your medicine. You're just gonna be just fine. Okay, you can just. I'm, I'm not the young. <laughs> I was going on my nerves though. But um, the day and the night I was sitting there. It was so cool, guys. I'm not even exaggerating. This was fun, to be honest, because it only hurt in the morning, and I got treated like a king. I was like, hey, peasants, give me, give me, give me some broth, you know, like chicken broth or whatever. It's like soupish kind of stuff. I don't know. Bang, I got it. Hey, pizza, please, peasants. <laughs> pizza. <laughs> um, I got, bro, this freaking bumblebee, this man dressed in a freaking costume, bumblebee, bro. Comes in my room, the most realistic one I've ever seen, bro. It was dope. And they gave me presents. I got a pet, like, this dog stayed in my room for, like, half an hour. It was cool. Like, I'm saying, it was a fun experience. Because in the children's hospital, I finally had a TV, so I had something to do. You know me. I'm a little, I'm a kid. Messing around with the recliner thing. Uh, yeah, and then I think the day I got surgery, I got to leave. Whew! You have no idea how many stomach muscles you use. Until you cannot use your stomach, bro. My stomach, okay, like getting up, bro. I you should you should have saw me getting up. I'd be like this. I'd be like, 
because it hurt so bad, and if I got up, just normally kill me. <laughs> and sadly, my birthday was like three days after that. Um, so yeah, that was sucked. And coughing, bro, the worst. Like, I, I don't know why. I've never had a cough so much in my entire life. But when I finally hurt to use my stomach, I have to cough that much. But yeah, it sucked. And I had to put like teddy bear on my stomach or whatever they gave me, you know, like you had to push down, like put pressure on it, it would hurt with a cough. But yeah, basically, um, that is how it happened, guys. Um, yeah, so that's what we're still talking about my appendicitis, guys. I don't know if it was interesting. If it was, leave a like down below on the video. And, um, <sighs> if, you're, if you're new and it's your first time seeing my face on the screen, Click that subscribe button, join A Squad, best squad in YouTube game, and I'll see all you guys in the next video.